Hey, Mitch, the RV guy here for RVs of Sacramento, bringing you another incredible travel trailer. This is a 2020 Jayco J Flight. It's the 174BH, or bunkhouse. This is the XLS Baja Edition. The Baja Edition gives you that great ground clearance, making an extremely versatile trailer. Weighs less than 3,100 pounds, and you can sleep almost everybody. This is fantastic, guys. I'm gonna start out by showing you the inside, go over a couple of the features that sets Jayco apart, then we'll go around the outside, Talk about the construction difference between Jayco and the other manufacturers. You'll find out why they're able to give you that two-year warranty on the coach itself and three-year structure warranty. That is 100% better than other manufacturers and why they've been the best-selling travel trailer 15 years in a row with better resale value than anybody. Let's get started. Inside is a lot more space than you think. We've got this large bed up here at the front for sleeping the two adults, a nice dining area where you can actually remove the table and turn it into just a sitting and relax area large kitchen and two bunks that are capable of sleeping full-sized adults. Let me show you. Starting out on the inside, we've got your beautiful kitchen area here. This is actual real wood storage on the Jayco here too. This is screwed and glued cabinetry, extremely important. It also has backing plates in the walls that it's in. Large, large for this size counter space here that you actually get with a nice high-rise sink, a suburban high output cooktop, and of course, your Dometic refrigerator freezer. And everywhere that you can have storage space, this Jayco is gonna give you additional storage space. High point microwave that you have right there, all LED lighting throughout. And of course, the nice thing about these bunks, a lot of the ones are gonna have bunks, but they're only rated for 200 pounds, 250 pounds, some of them 150. This is a real plywood base on this. Folks, these are 300 pound bunks that you get here. So. Uncle Jeb can get on here no problem. He's not going to be falling through and collapsing on the grandkids. Uh, this is also a really big deal in the Jayco. Of course, you got your skylight, but Jayco actually has fully supported shower basins. What I mean by that is notice that the shower is always raised off the ground. That's in order to let the plumbing come down to there with a P-trap. Most manufacturers have the showers on stilts, so it's literally hollow underneath there where the kids are going to be. And if you know kids, they can be a little violent when it comes to jumping around. On the Jayco, it's fully supported. You don't have to worry about that caving in on you like you do on a lot of the other manufacturers when you have children. Not being exactly as, as polite as they could be with property. You have the Bluetooth radio, which is nice. You can sync and listen to your tunes. A nice dining table area with the removable table, which right now I've removed and put onto the bed to show you how it kind of opens up the space in here. And then, of course, speaking of the bed, you have this beautiful large bed that actually has the windows on each side for cross ventilation, plus the front window for a good view and additional storage space all throughout. This has also got a 5 eighths inch tongue and groove marine grade plywood floor with double insulation. Same thing for the roof, double insulated roof, guys. That is one of the main reasons why the Jayco's hold up so well. Outside, you got that beautiful Jayco styling along with the window that you can see through that's actually UV tinted all the windows to stop the sun's rays from coming in and destroying your interior. This is a Norco frame, the strongest frame pound per pound in the industry, which is incredibly important for you to have a strong frame. For example, most all manufacturers, the frame integrates with the A-frame right there. So this little A-channel stops right there at that first at that first uh, intersection. The Jayco actually continues on and it intersects with the eye channel on this side of the frame on each side. The, and then Jayco also gives you additional outriggers. Those are the steel beams that connect each side of your slide room, uh, or each side of your frame to the eye beams. It's like the ribs. A Jayco's are four to six feet apart. Other manufacturers can be eight feet apart. That is a massive, massive difference on the strength of your frame. And if you don't have a strong frame, what that means is that your sidewalls are gonna have to support the difference in the weight and you don't want that a large power awning just hold down the button and you got shade in the summertime with marine grade speakers on each side and of course the nice nice look of this Jayco SLX is not just looking nice it's high quality too for example this aluminum here is 0 0.30 inches on most other manufacturers it's 0 0.22 inches some of them go to 0 0.24 not the Jayco even their roof is insanely overbuilt. The Jayco roof here is called the Magnum Trust Roof System. It's rated for 4,500 pounds for a RV roof. Folks, that is unheard of. One of the main reasons is they give you two by two real wood studs that hold up the trusses on the roof. Other manufacturers give you these tiny little frail aluminum studs that hold up your roof. Aluminum, like aluminum can. Jayco also gives you two oversized nail plates on the side of both its trusses and its oversized support studs. 
Guys, at 4,500 pounds, the Jayco roof is fine. At 3,000 pounds, the other manufacturer's roofs start caving in. And at 4,500 pounds, the roofs literally collapse. Jayco roofs are also screwed down. 3 8 inch plywood as opposed to stapled down plywood and god forbid a lot of them use stapled down osb board you are not getting that in the jayco one of the main reasons they're able to give you the industry leading warranty and better resale value